Good afternoon. This is December 22nd, or December, yeah, it looks like December, February 22nd, 2018. Yesterday, or the day before, we had 70 degrees here where I live in western, southern New York uh, state. And uh, today, we're getting five to seven inches of snow. Um, beginning pictures here with the dogs out enjoying it coming in. It's been a while since I did a video. Uh, I had a close friend pass away and uh, kind of took the wind out of me filming very much. Uh, but anyway, we're going to look things over today for the daily blooms. Got quite a lot to catch up and look at. Some we probably missed. There's a beauty right there. Uh, a cat we of some sort. I'm not going to bother getting the name down now. There are some more beautiful ones on the inside too. Uh, this frag is still going strong. I don't know, it's been blooming for what, several months now? Both, both uh, spikes. They're still blooming, uh, not showing any signs of abating. Uh, that's the second spike back there with another bloom coming. This is the first spike that's had well over 20, uh, 20 shoots on it now. Another beautiful one out here that I uh, wanted to show you before it went over. That van that is still going, I took that to my friend's passing funeral because he loved purple and knew he'd like it. But here's a beauty. This is doesn't seem to have lasted very long, but it's beautiful. Uh, bright orange, peach, I don't know what color you call it, but uh, anyway, it's quite a beautiful one and uh, really doing neat. Uh, I've had a few uh, bulbophyllums that have bloomed, but they don't seem to last very long. Here, this one is still blooming nicely. Uh, the aggregatum up here is going over. I did show that in a previous video. This uh, weird Dracula has been in bloom for quite a while now. Uh, I'm just doing this quick update because it's been a while, well it's been over two weeks or so since I've done a posting and uh, hopefully things are starting to get back to normal and I'll get back on a regular schedule. Uh, I don't know if anything else is in bloom here or not. That yellow one is here somewhere. Uh, oh up there. There's the yellow vanda. I took several flowers to my friend's funeral. Uh, he used to help me a lot in uh, working in the orchids. Uh, here is my only dendrobium. I've had it for several years and this year it has given me some a boom. You can see. I don't know what it is. I don't have much luck with dendrobiums. Here's a pretty uh, Pretty orange catlia. I do have a beautiful orange catlia inside. I may try to go in. I've got a nice mass devalia down here, starting to bloom. Uh, in fact, there's a couple inside I want to show you. Uh, I'll take another look at this beautiful one right there. And there's one more out here too, if I can find it, that I got. Uh, at my Orchid Society show. Uh, 
two or three years ago from a guy, I think was, he was from Pennsylvania, mounted one. Let me get it down. It'll be the easiest thing to do, I think. Well, maybe it will be, maybe it won't be. Uh, there we go. This is a pretty one, too. He had crossed it himself. And, uh... It just bloomed for me. I think I've had it three years, maybe. And it's bloomed each year. Doing nicely. Now if I can get inside, I wanna show you the, I wanna show you the orchids that are blooming in there. Uh, that's probably about it for out here. I know this isn't going to be the best video today because it's very bright outside. You can see it's like a winter wonderland, which is okay, but winter's getting old. But where I am, we don't get winter until over until probably end of April, first part of May. But there's a shade house over there, so I'm going to pause it. We go inside. 